And isn't it great how oh. the Padres have really incorporated oh the military on Sundays? The I mean, Padres were the first to do this. I see now I go <laughs> watch our Mets game on TV. They're wearing camouflage uniforms. wonder where that came from. Yeah. I think that was my Padres <laughs> who started that and honoring the military and bringing them in and sitting them out the stands for free on, on uh, Sunday ball games and, and doing the Marine hymn and becoming a big part of Padre tradition. They've been so involved, so involved. And uh, Jack Ench was their military liaison. I've, I've learned to call Jack friend. And uh, Jack was amazing. Had a missing thumb when they shot him down over Hanoi mm. and uh, lost his thumb. And the best part was he was, he was flying his plane, a F4 Phantom. I'm not sure about that, but uh, he was on the Midway. He was on the Midway, which is now the museum here, but it was hot. It was in battle then. And mm -hmm. when you leave, you got to sign out on the logbook. And then when you come in and you have your mission accomplished, you sign in on the logbook. Mm -hmm. Jack never signed in on the logbook. He signed out. He got shot down. He spent years in a, in a Hanoi prison and then was released when they had the big release. And then Jack went on his own to the Midway Museum, found the logbook, and signed in. Mission oh, accomplished. Beautiful. I get to be around men like that because I'm in sports and the military and the Padres. You can't be any prouder. You can't be any prouder of them. Unbelievable. That's it. That's it. That's man. what I've gotten uh, exposed to as, 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 as not just the athletes and their toughness and their dedication. But all of that. And like I said, if I'm a big uh, entrepreneur here, I'm hiring ex-jocks and ex-military. They get the task done. They are totally dedicated. It's yes, sir, no, sir. And they are, as, as David Halberstam said, the best and brightest.